Hello, today I'm going to be reviewing Batman the Complete Animated Series uh, on Blu-ray. Now this Blu-ray um, contains all 85 episodes of Batman the Animated Series, I think, and all 24 episodes of Batman of the New Batman Adventures, which is like the follow-up show. Uh, but they just call it Season 3, even, yeah. So, <sighs> the price ranges from about, uh, 40, 50 to sometimes 60 something dollars. Don't know how much I got this one for, I forget, but, yeah, it's a pretty good price for what it is. I mean, when you add up all the episodes, it's something like 109, so. But anyway, here's the front artwork. Batman, the complete animated series. Nice picture of Batman and Robin there. DC, Blu-ray plus digital. Now it says you have to redeem the digital code by then, but uh, I, I don't think those code, those expiration dates actually mean anything because I've redeemed plenty of digital codes after the expiration date and it still works on the top. Batman, the complete animated series. Bottom, a bunch of stuff like that, like uh, legal information, and here's the run times, Batman the Animated Series and Batman the New Adventures, because they combine them, 2,391 minutes, and then Batman Mask of the Phantasm, 76 minutes, and Batman and Mr. Freeze Sub-Zero, 67 minutes, those are also included, I forgot to mention, uh, two of the movies, <laughs> The Spine, Batman the Complete Animated Series, DC, Warner Brothers. Take a look at the back. The Legendary Series, like you've never seen before. A little description there. Pause if you want to read that. And 12 disc set includes some bonus features. Yeah, all 109 action packed episodes. 35 hours of crime fighting. And it comes with a digital copy, which, I mean, you can't, you, you can't, uh, redeem it on all services. I haven't redeemed mine because I can't find a service to redeem it on, but, yeah, and I'm not going to show you the digital code because I want to keep that. I haven't redeemed it yet, so. And, uh, yeah, let's show you what's inside. So, uh, here's part one and part two. Let's take a look at part one first. Batman, the complete animated series. Here's the spine, part one. Back. Picture of Batman and Joker on the front. This is Batman. Now, I should note that when I took the shrink wrap off this, uh, the slip cover, both these were in here, and in between them, I believe, was the digital code and the episode guide. So keep that in mind, but I put them in the cases. So, let's open this up. There's the episode guide. Let's take a look at that first. Batman, complete it's just the same as the front, really. And then open it up. Season, I think this is the second page, actually. Yeah, it's the second page. Season one, disc one. It's got special features on each disc, I think, too. Disc two. Disc 3, Disc 4, and some of the episodes have commentary, but not all of them. But I think that's pretty cool anyway. Disc 5, which is of Season 1, and Season 2, Disc 1, Disc 2, and Season 3, Disc 1, and Disc 2. And then... 
bonus disc, which comes with the special features, some more than are on the regular discs, and then Batman Mask of the Phantasm, Batman and Mr. Freeze Sub-Zero, and even more special features, which actually comes with some episodes from some other shows, like Batman Beyond. And that's the episode guide, and we got a picture of Batman on the back. And since these discs are reflective, I'm gonna, I actually I might want to take that out so I can show you the discs. They'll have the same artwork as far as I'm aware, but uh, season one, disc one, season one, disc two, season one, disc three, season one, disc four. Season 1, Disc 5, Season 1, Season 2, Disc 1, and that's Part 1 in the Case 1, and then we got Part 2, it's a uh, different artwork than what's on the front, like the first one, and there's a spine, Part 2, and then on the back we got a picture of uh, Robin and Two-Face. Open it up. I normally keep the digital code in here, but I don't have it in here because um, I don't want you seeing that. Anyway, season two, disc two. Season three, disc one. Season three, disc two. And a uh, bonus disc with the special features. And then we have Batman Mask of the Phantasm and Batman and Mr. Freeze Sub-Zero. And I think that is everything it comes with. So overall, I think if you're a fan of Batman like I am, and I also have watched Batman the Animated Series, uh, I haven't watched the new Batman Adventures or Batman and Mr. Freeze Sub-Zero, but I have also seen Batman and Mask of the Phantasm. But this is definitely worth it if you're a Batman fan, uh, especially of the animated series. It looks great, it looks much better than the DVDs. Um, I think they did a good job with like the remastering and everything. And uh, so yeah, that's going to be it for this video, and I'll see you in the next video.